Hey guys, what's up? It's Bibs87 here again, and welcome to another RuneScape video. This one's going to be about the new update that came out today, Soul Reaper. I was about to go do my Water Fiends task, but screw that! Soul Reaper came out today! Let's go! So here in Draenor, it looks like this is where we go to get to the Soul Reaper spot here, Death's Portal. Heading on through that right about now. Let's just, uh, see, we get a new music track, uh, Death, and we're going to go talk to him. He should be right here. Yep, hey, what's up, buddy? And let's see what he says. Hey, what up? You talk way too much. Alright, Grim Gem, this is like your Slayer Gem for this new uh, this new thing. Uh, I don't want group bosses. Three Araxi, are you kidding me? That's like the worst thing I could have gotten. You know what, screw it, I'm gonna do it. Yes, certainly thanks, because I don't want to get less XP. If You, you can switch it up to five times with less XP each time. But, yeah, I want, I want to do it. Where's the rewards at? Are there any rewards for this crap? Okay, here we go. These things look pretty nuts. You can spend Slayer points on these. So, either 20 death points, or boss Slayer points, or 200 Slayer points. Damn, the Slayer points are a lot more. So these are, I think, consumable. Maybe not. I don't know, it doesn't say consumable. But it definitely could be. This thing is only usable for boss Slayer points for the new gem. But yeah, I'm pretty sure these are all consumables uh, let's see effects this looks cool as heck I want this definitely a rainbow loop beam um, and I, I want to buy like all these things because they're all um, they're all permanent effects you can permanently reduce the cost of your instance by 25% like please that would be awesome permanently increase your bonfire health boost by 25% that's a whole lot of slayer points Jesus Christ and then the rainbow loop beams that sounds just cool as heck so yeah, definitely. And then there's titles. Final boss title. That's the one everyone knows about because a friend made a video about it. So that sounds pretty cool. Uh, that one's going to be hard as heck to get. But, um... Oh! Okay, you can, uh... You can make how much uh, loot beam you want. Okay, the next Calphite King are in here. Like, I'd take those, but I don't want Virago or Rise of the Six. I guess I'll turn them on. Because I can always just say I'd rather skip Nex and Calphite, I mean, Virago and Rise of the Six. But yeah, we got, whoops, uh, we got a Raxi, so we're going to go kill it. Just putting this out there, I suck balls at uh, a Raxor, so I'm probably going to die or fail or mess up something. But, you know, we're going to give it a go. So uh, let's see how this works out. Although I honestly don't expect me to do it in uh, in my first try. But, you know, we'll see. So, yeah. Just totally snaked my way into this room. Uh, nobody was in here. About to log out if he's not the right style. Because, uh... Yep, fuck that. <laughs> I need him to be mage. Or I really can't do it because I suck. So, yeah. My Slayer Helm better give me boost for this. Because otherwise I'm wearing it for no reason. And I should be wearing Warpriest Helm. Because, uh, yeah, that's the best setup for this. But I... I think the Slayer Helm will be more worth it if it gives you the actual boost, which I think it does, so hopefully that's the case, but um, yeah, let's see if he's going to be mage this time, because uh, I really need him to be mage, or I'm going to struggle because I am really bad at this. Okay, he's mage, so let's, uh, potion, potion, I don't even remember how to do this, like, I, I did it once, I've killed this thing once, and we move, okay, we got out of the way, and he's gonna, he's already taken away my yak, like, he literally killed my entire yak the last time I did this. But, um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Oh, you know what else? He's going to increase and get harder because every time I fight him because of that bullshit. So that's going to be even harder for me to kill him three times. But, yeah, this is sick. Which paths are even open? I don't even know. Oh, sick. The only path I know how to do is the middle path, and it's closed. This is great. Honestly, that's actually true. I don't even know how to do the other paths. Oh, shit, I forgot to anticipation. Oh, I suck at this so bad. Burn the web. Burn it. Let's go. Oh, stand on that shit. Oh, yep, yep, stand on that shit. Oh, sick. It just destroyed them. Okay, I don't even know how to do this path, and it's going pretty well so far. Oh, no, not the mirror back. I want the mirror back. No, I clicked it like four times, game. Move it on, move it on. What the fuck? He's not supposed to do two attacks in a row. Come on, Jagex, fix your boss. Why does it hit me 1200? 
Hello, I'm clearly standing right on the thing. See ya! And this is where it gets hard. Yes, this is where it gets real hard. F I fucking hit Z, dude. We got Got him. First try. Proud of myself. What we get? Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, that was worth it. All those brews and shit. You've got to be kidding me. Snaked. Mm, I clicked away. This game is garbage. So we killed our three Araxor uh, for the task, and that gave us 20,000 Slayer XP, which kind of isn't that much, really. But I was looking on the page, and it says you can get up to five Araxor from three to five. And no matter how many you get, you still get the same amount of XP. So I got, guess I guess I got lucky getting only three, because I don't think I would have been able to kill it again because of the enragement. I don't know, I really suck at that boss, especially the last phase. I just, I don't know, I suck at it really bad. Um, if I had ascensions, I could probably do it pretty easily. Because I hit so many zeros is the thing. But, um, yeah, now that I got that, I got 20,000 Slayer experience and 20 reward Reaper point things. So, I can only buy this thing, the Aura Refresh tier, and that is... Or refresh tier one, and that is it. And that's like a good amount of points for a task. Um, that's the most points you can get in a solo task is 20. Uh, the other task that can give 20 is Rise of the Six, and then Virago can give 20. And Virago is the best point giving task if you do hard mode, you'll get 25 points. So that's pretty ridiculous. Uh, if you want to do Virago hard mode to get 25 points, I mean, pretty much, reasonably, the absolute minimum amount of time it'll take to get one of these new gems in the game is 20 days. If someone gets Araxor, Rise of the Six, or Virago every single day, which is unlikely, but it could happen. So that's kind of uh, a long time for this update to be out and not have the item in the game. I'm going to be doing a task every single day, so if you guys would like to see a daily video on my boss slayer task for that day, I'd love to make a series like that. I think that'd be really cool, so let me know in the comments if that's something you guys are interested in. But um, yeah, I think I want to buy this rainbow loot beam. That sounds cool as heck, and I have plenty of slayer points to spend on it. So let's turn that on, and uh, yep, yeah, that, that sounds... That sounds good. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, that's a really long time for this gem, though, to be into the game. I mean, I guess if you factor in hard mode, maybe if they got Arago Rise of the Six or Araxor every single day, maybe it would be like 18 days or, or, or a little bit less because of the five extra points if they did hard mode, but you'd have to get insanely lucky to even get all those tasks. But um, 
yeah, we got the rainbow loop beam, so I, I guess I'll try and show that off in uh, my next Slayer episode or something. But yeah, let me know if you guys would like to see something like that series in the comments below. And um, let me know how your boss Slayer is going. Did you get your first task yet? Are you planning to? What was it? Did you get any good loot? And all that stuff. So uh, I think this is a great update, really cool. Kind of stinks you can only do it once a day, but uh, still... It's awesome. I think maybe you can uh, use daily D&D &D tokens and get more than one task a day. That'd be awesome. Uh, because I think I have some of those that I got off the, the thing uh, in here somewhere. Oh, and also the total loot I got from Araxor was this right here. 1.9 mil. I think I got pretty unlucky. I got those eight magic seeds, which was good. But then I got like two terrible cash drops. So that was kind of lame. But yeah. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Like and favorite, you did. Subscribe for future videos and leave a comment down below on what you thought. See you guys next time. Peace.